Welcome to the third international conference on educational innovation and philosophical inquiries. My name is Ivo Ganchev and I teach at Queen Mary University of London. It is my great pleasure to see that so many of you have joined this excellent event, which offers a platform for new contributions to help shape the future of education. The delivery mode of educational courses has changed profoundly over the past years, as it is becoming increasingly reliant on technology. This requires innovation that is not purely intended to solve technical problems, but also well thought out at the conceptual level. Taking such considerations into account is essential when we think about issues such as reshaping the curricula that we deliver, and we need to find new and meaningful ways for engagement and interaction with students. The conference today seeks to facilitate interdisciplinary discussions that touch on the fundamental philosophical questions which underpin issues of practical relevance in the field of education, but also draw on other disciplines such as uh, psychology or sociology. We are excited that there is a community of outstanding and diverse researchers who have joined us at this important conference today. The event can hopefully offer all of you a platform to build connections between educators, students, and industry experts from very, very different backgrounds. It is exactly these types of interactions that enable us to move one step closer towards bridging the gap between theory and practice in education. The conference was originally planned to be held in Stanford, California, but for the safety of our participants and the effectiveness and convenience of academic exchange and communication, we decided to hold this year's edition virtually. Still, I'm delighted to announce that we have a fantastic list of speakers and that this conference is an excellent opportunity to engage with them and to learn more about the research which is at the forefront of the social sciences and the humanities. You can browse the full list of participants on our program, but first let me share a few words about some of our distinguished speakers. We're very happy to welcome Professor Paul Golden from the University of Pennsylvania, where he chairs the Department of East Asian Languages and Civilizations. He is also a fellow at the School of Historical Studies at Princeton University. His main area of research is classical Chinese history and philosophy, which ranges from the Bronze Age to late antiquity. As the study of this period is necessarily interdisciplinary, his work also involves archaeology, art, history, linguistics, literature, and religion. He has published more than 10 books and more than 50 articles, including Lu Jia's New Discourses, a political manifesto from the early Han Dynasty, as well as The Art of Chinese Philosophy, Eight Classical Texts, and How to Read Them. Today, Professor Golden will be explaining to us how classical Chinese works. Our next distinguished guest is Professor Enrico Palandri from University College London, where he holds the posts of Writer-in-Residence and Professor of Modern European Literature. He has given talks on literature at universities around the world, including in South Africa, Russia, China, and other countries. Professor Palandri's novels, articles, and essays have appeared in multiple languages and have received numerous prizes including the uh, Fenice Europa and others. His uh, books, Pierre, which came out in 2005, and Primo Levi, which came out in 2011, are a monograph and an anthology. And they have prefaces and commentaries which contextualize the corpus of work written by these two Italian authors. The volumes... La Deriva Romantica from 2002 and Flow from 2011 are books with a very strong theoretical focus. 
In 2003, he was conferred the title of Commendatore um, in the Order of the Star of Italian Solidarity for his cultural contributions by the Italian president at the time. Professor Palandri's topic today is the landscape around the teaching of humanities. And last but not least, we have Associate Professor Eric Patrick from the Department of Radio, Television, and Film at Northwestern University. With over 25 years of experience in the entertainment industry, his commercial animation and independent experimental works have received a Peabody Award, a Guggenheim Fellowship, over 100 grants, fellowships, and awards at international film festivals, as well as several Emmy nominations. His additional work in information design has received grants from the National Institute of Health and the Chicago Digital Media Production Fund. He has screened extensively both domestically and internationally at festivals, museums, and on television, including at the Rotterdam Film Festival, the Museum of Modern Art, the Center, Georges Pompidou in Paris, and others. He was an animator for the seminal Nickelodeon program, Blue's Clues, and has written several articles about independent animation. Today, Professor Patrick will tell us about the lost art of praxis in contemporary pedagogy. Before we move on to the main part of the event, I would also like to announce the delightful news that Papers accepted by our conference this year will be published in Lecture Notes in Education Psychology and Public Media or Communications in Humanities Research according to the relevant research field. Now, this is our third conference already, and the future of this event is looking very bright for many more years to come. I would like to thank all of our participants, all of you, for choosing it as a platform for presenting your research. And we sincerely hope that you will enjoy the presentations that will follow. From all of us, we hope to see you again in person or online very soon. We wish you all the best. And please enjoy the conference. <laughs>